Hi guys, it's Ben here and welcome to another episode of Day Trip. Today we've gone to North London to watch Enfield Town take on Chelmsford City in their first home pre-season game of the 2017-18 campaign. Now this is a game that I'm really excited to see. I've heard a lot of good things about Enfield Town. I've seen a couple of other ground hoppers doing some vlogs here. Uh, so they were founded in 2001 in protest at how Enfield were being run. Uh, so this club is very young, very new. This is a new stadium they've just moved to. Um, and they're in the Isthmian Premier Division. Chelmsford City are in the uh, National League South, I believe. So yeah, decent game on offer. It's a nice Tuesday night, straight from work, train from Liverpool Street to Enfield. Uh, 7.45 kickoff, four quid to get in. It's a nice non-league football. Um, as I say, I've heard a lot of good things about these fans, some good people around here. A lot of passionate football fans. They get good crowds here, more than most, most uh, teams at this level manage. So yeah, I'm excited to see what sort of football we get tonight. Cheers, mate. Thank you. So, running track by day, football stadium by night, it seems. Huge, huge surface area around here. But a nice little set in for football. A calf back there. Lovely evening. Pump for this. So, here's the football ground snack, will it beat the hot dog at Wimbledon? It won't have to do much to beat that, to be honest with you. First impressions are pretty good. Solid, solid crispy bacon, you know, very important. No onions, didn't even get offered onions, which is disappointing. But at least they're not burnt like Saturday. We're excited for you. One is Joe Wright. Two, Mickey Parcel. Three, a trialist. Here come the lads. Most of the uh, Enfield side are trialists tonight. Whether it's So it's taken Enfield just two minutes to score. Uh, not the best piece of goalkeeping, but a long shot came from the edge of the box. Striker came in and followed up. The reason why my camera jolted when they scored is because this bloke here decided to uh, slap me when it went in. But um, we've just noticed people having beers. I completely forgot that you can get beers at this sort of level. So as soon as I saw a pint, it's straight to the bar. And it looks like it could be one all. Is it going to be one all? Oh, off the line. Frantic start here at Enfield. To the bar it is. What are we having? Cronenberg, please. Cronenberg will do me. Smart little bar area. This lovely place to watch a game from. The view's just really nice indeed. So far, so good. Enfield Town. What a better thing to do than sip a pint from the bar whilst having the game going on outside the window. Look at this. Don't get that in Premier League. I wish you did. I think he throws a lot of doesn't he? So in amongst all that beer nonsense, we did miss a goal. It's now one all. So. Uh, no messing around in this game, one all after about 10 minutes. Can't argue with that. What a finish that was, 2-1 to Chelmsford. They've come from behind, just 15 minutes in, it was already 2-1. That was a lovely finish, they opened this body up. Thierry Henri-esque in a way, put that past the keeper. Looks like it's going to be an entertaining night. Beers, loads of goals, nice weather. So far this is beating Wimbledon. Former Southampton star Lee Barnard warming up for Chelmsford City. Saw him at Braintree last year when I went there for a Torquay game. The burger, by the way, gets a 7 out of 10. I think the, the bacon was very crispy, which is nice. The cheese was grated and just sort of went a bit everywhere. Um, not a huge issue, but it's not my preference. And the burger was just solid. So yeah, 7 out of 10. I would have liked some onions, would have liked some sort of something a bit different in there, something crunchy, but yeah, better than the Wimbledon hot dog. Got barbecue sauce. Barbecue sauce, yeah. Uh, there was some hot chilli sauce, which this fellow enjoyed. Um, so yeah, overall, and a good price, four quid. Um, I'm, I'm more than happy with that. Oh, that is lovely. Oh, the bar. Lovely move from Chelmsford. I've already got these two. 
Rough and tumble. <laughs> so half time, 2 1, good game here. Um, this first 15 minutes in particular were pretty mental. Uh, three goals, we missed one of them because we're getting a pint. But yeah, I, I like the vibe down here. It's pretty chilled. I mean, obviously, in a league game, I'd expect it to be a bit more atmospheric i've seen some of the other videos and yeah there's a lot of ultras that do turn up on league games but and they're all making their way around here now for the second half as um enfield will be shooting this way second half hopefully there'll be some action here um but yeah decent game decent ground um good little outing meanwhile real widespread reports now saying that neymar's gonna join uh, psg is there anything that i mean for, i just can't believe it these, these sort of deals always seem to you know, come about. There's they're always been reported on Twitter and stuff, but I never seem to believe him. Like, there's always rumours that Messi's going to go to Man City and stuff. Neymar to PSG for 222 million seems to be breaking today. Don't know what to make of it. Let me know in the comments whether you think that's actually going to happen or not. By the time this gets uploaded, I suppose we might already know. But uh, huge if true. Heading back down to the other end, see if we're going to get some more chumps for action. Been to the club shop, got some sweets on board. Uh, so yeah, let's enjoy the last half an hour or so of this game. Still 2-1, it's quieting down a lot since the first 15 minutes, but um, still aiming for a good, good end. So I've just gone to the toilet and come back and I've missed another goal, it seems. It was the most boring 20 minutes of football of all time before that, and I've just gone to the toilet, come back. Chelmsford now lead 3-1. They just made about 11 subs before I went to the toilet, so I think it's all pretty much trial it's on the pitch now. But yeah, 3-1 to Chelmsford. Fortunately, Harry saw the goal. Harry, described the goal for us. A uh, bit of a scramble in the box. Came out to the edge of the box, and uh, I couldn't, couldn't see the number, but uh, he, he just rifled it in from about 20 yards into the, the top right. Goal, he didn't move. There you go. So the time that I need to go for a piss, uh, we see the greatest goal since Paul Scholes against Villa. So yeah, 3-1. Um, Definitely think a return to this place in the league season is in order to do this place justice. It's a nice little ground. Um, the fans are great from what I've seen. Obviously, they're pretty quiet tonight. It's a friendly, but yeah, I do want to come back to this place. But do let me know in the comments where you are from and like you know other grounds I should go to. I'm obviously southern based in London, so preferably in around the area. But yeah, any non-league grounds that you think got a good atmosphere at any time, let me know. I'll try and make my way down there because I do like coming to these non-league games. Um, you know, you get to meet real people. There's a real community feel to it. Um, and you can have a drink as well, so yeah, it's good fun. So yeah, please do let me know where I should go next. Oh, that must have absolutely killed. Oh! <laughs> you can do anything, that's the guy who scored. Hey. Oh, I just don't trust this bloke. Oh, okay. He's a, that's a penalty. <laughs> Lee Barnard's a legend. Former oh, Premier League star. Don't want to get too wet. Literally one or two minutes to go. Chelmsford are coasting to victory. Probably should have scored one or two more. A few people making their way to the exits. Not bringing the jacket, not his best decision. Thank you for the attendance this evening. Don't forget Saturday went home to Skelmersdale. So they have it, Chelmsford do beat Enfield Town 3-1 in that pre-season friendly. And to sum up the place, I really like it. I really like the area. It's very quiet, it's not intimidating at all. Really nice part of London by the looks of things. Um, and the ground, fairly nice. I mean, it's a shame that the athletics track is there. Like, if you want to stand on the side, you are quite far away from the pitch. That's the only downside. I do wish they'd sort of move the barriers in. You could stand right by the pitch. But behind the goal, the view's great. Um, 
The fans are great, they're in full voice. Um, I can only imagine what it's like in a league game. As I say, it's a shame it was a friendly because I don't get to experience the full atmosphere and the passion of the place, but you still get a good feel for the environment, the people. Um, everyone's very friendly. Everything's really good value. I mean, beer was good, well priced, food was nice. Um, ticket was four quid to get, and I think for a league game it's normally 11, so um, I really can't have any complaints with the value or the atmosphere. Um, definitely want to come back for a league game. Um, and I do wish them all the best in the Isthmian League this season. So yeah, as I say, any recommendations for grounds, especially in and around London, will be, will be appreciated. Um, I do want to try and get out and about more. They want to go up north, maybe go to like Salford or AFC Liverpool, some really interesting teams that around the country. But yeah, hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments what you thought of it. Let me know if you've been to Enfield before and you know what you thought of it. Is it any better on a league game? I'm sure it is. Uh, and let me know any suggestions of ground you want me to go to. Hope you enjoyed the video guys. Please do subscribe to my channel for all this sort of stuff. Drop a like, share the video for me and follow my other socials. It's Ben Say on Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat and Facebook and I'll see you next time.